Hello everyone. The story I'm going to share today is the consequences of a wrong thought. There was a scholar in the Ming Dynasty who was born into a very wealthy family. His parents engaged him to a girl from another wealthy family when he was young. His parents were very kind people and often gave money to help others. In the end, they had even used up all the family property just to help others. Finally, by the time his parents passed away, their family was no different from ordinary families. At this time, he gradually grew up, and it was time to get married. Meanwhile, the other wealthy family regretted the engagement because they didn't want to marry their daughter to a poor young man. But in ancient China, people paid great attention to their trustworthiness. Thus, the wealthy family could not publicly regret the engagement. So they had a maid of the family pretending to be their daughter, married the young man. The scholar didn't know the truth at the time and thought his wife was the daughter of that wealthy family. One day, the scholar had a strange dream. In the dream, he came to a wonderful place where the buildings and pavilions were so splendid. That they could not imagine in the human world, he unintentionally walked into a palace-like place and saw several beautiful girls inside, who were embroidering a brocade robe. The scholar approached them and curiously asked, "What was this brocade robe was for?" They replied, "This is the dress for the next champion in the imperial examination." Upon hearing this. He looked carefully and found his name embroidered on the brocade robe. At that moment, he woke up. He was very excited, and at the same time, he remembered that his parents had done many good deeds and accumulated a lot of virtue. He was obviously destined to be the champion. From then on, he became a little carried away and started to look down on others. There's a saying from the ancients: If you do not want others to know, better do not do anything. Soon after, the story that rich family had used the maid to marry him instead of their daughter spread and came to his ears. Some people used this to ridicule him. He went home and immediately asked his wife about a gossip, and she told him the whole story of the replacement. After hearing this, he became furious and thought, "How can I, a top scholar, marry a maid as my wife? When I become a champion in the future, I will definitely find a way to divorce her." Not long after, in his dream, he went to that fairy land again, and the embroidering girls were still there, but their attitude toward him was very cold. He looked carefully at his name on the brocade robe. It was blurry and about to disappear. He was shocked and quickly asked why this was happening. The girls replied, "This man has recently had an evil thought of abandoning his wife. God has noticed it and has ordered a replacement." After hearing this, he woke up startled. After he woke up, he felt extremely regretful. And began to deeply repent having had such evil thought. He vowed to stay with his wife the whole life, and never look down on his wife because of her status as a maid servant. Since then, he has strictly kept his promise. For more than ten years, the husband and wife were able to maintain mutual respect as before. Later, as expected, he won the championship. The first prize in the imperial examination. From then on, he got promoted constantly and became one of the ministers at the imperial court. This story tells us that every thought we have in the human world is clearly known to God, and may have consequences. Thank you very much for listening to the story. More touching stories will be ready for you if you just subscribe. Thank you again.